Hello and welcome, today we'll learn how to discard or sell an asset using the asset management module. We'll click on the asset list and click on the discard or sell button without selecting an asset. The module will provide a pop-up suggesting you select an asset first as shown. We'll then select an asset from the asset list and click on discard or sell button to open the asset disposal form. One inside you'll see different mandatory and non-mandatory fields here. We'll move ahead and close the form to select multiple assets at one go. Once selected, we'll again click on the discard or sell button to open up the asset disposal form. Here you'll be able to see the details of all the three selected assets as shown here. We'll again exit the form to unselect two of the assets and move forward with the asset disposal. Inside the disposal form, we'll fill in a hypothetical sold value for the asset, showing us the price difference between the purchase price and the sold value. We can fill in the desired remarks and fill in a hypothetical written down value. The location is set by default to where the asset belongs to. We'll then select the reason for disposal as write off from the drop down and move on to select the reason for disposal. We can then select a vendor name from the vendor name drop down. We can then fill in the remarks and upload any relevant files if required. The tax group refers to the tax regime being followed by the organization. The tax group might vary for each country and organization. Once saved, we'll see that the HP laptop is no longer visible in the list of assets as it has been disposed off. To view the recently disposed off asset, we can move to the report section from the left selection pane and navigate to discarded sold assets under Asset Management. Here we can see the recently disposed asset under the list of discarded slash sold assets. We can see all the details of the disposed assets in the list. We can also delete or restore the asset. We'll restore the asset just for your reference. Once restored, we'll move back to the asset list to find the asset being restored amongst the list of assets. That is all for the video on how to discard or sell an asset. See you in the next one.